First Alert Forecast with meteorologist Kyle Dickens. Yeah, general rule is if some if we're not seeing the weather, somebody is, and that's the case out in California right now. Hey, you can see right now, currently satellite radar shows all that activity moving in, uh, even down towards L.A. Really, the whole uh, state of Florida, excuse me, state of California, rather, is dealing with that activity. That continues to move on. That might actually be a system that we deal with come later in the week. We'll show that in exact track. Here's some other heavy activity down towards places. Look at that, Atlanta into Alabama, seeing really heavy activity, uh, and uh, really. This is where the axis of the moisture has been well to our south. Now we've been into some of the cloud cover uh, that uh, is coming off of that system, but overall we've been really, really blessed with some awesome weather this weekend. Great weekend to be out. Saw a lot of people out and about today, so hopefully you had a chance to get out and enjoy it. 45 degrees right now. Feels like 40 with that wind. We're going to watch though tonight as fog is going to build in. A better chance what we saw last night is we're gonna have a little bit lighter wind. Once we get to about 6 a.m., there's maybe down to a mile in some spots. Once again, Tuesday morning as well. So uh, gonna watch that, uh, but definitely patchy at that. So uh, you maybe want to give yourself a little extra time as you head out to work and school tomorrow. Other than that, clouds will move in and uh, move out by the time we get to the afternoon. Should see pretty much a copy and paste what we saw today and kind of been the whole story here for our weather pattern here the last several days. Well, that's going to continue on and once we get to Tuesday, we begin the changing process here as we look to uh, kind of change our pattern and that is going to come in the form of some rain showers and maybe even some thunderstorms as we get later in the week. Temperatures though, yeah, we'll get down into the 30s tonight, low 30s, maybe even upper 20s for some hometowns, but right back into the upper 40s, low 50s tomorrow. Maybe a little bit more cloud cover to the east, so might see a pretty big spread in temperatures, maybe a little bit cooler in places like Princeton, Sterling Rock Falls, up towards Savannah as well. But to the west and southwest, better chance some sunshine. You should see the 50s out there. Next seven days, though, we have several chances of rainfall uh, really starting once we get to Thursday. Let's time things out here. You can, 3 p.m. Thursday, okay? And you might be asking what What's this red blob? Well, that is actually, we might be warm enough to actually have a little energy to give us some thunderstorms. That's a possibility. I don't think we'll see anything severe at this time. We'll have to watch it. You get, you know, this time of year with uh, warm and cold air. Yeah, you can get some, uh, get some strong storms to develop. But looks like we'll just have enough energy maybe for a clap of thunder or two. Rain is going to move through into Friday as well. But on the back end of this, things are going to change once we get into the next weekend. Yeah, okay, there comes that uh, winter weather, and it is possible that we could see maybe some mixed precipitation, maybe even some snow come into parts of next week. The temperatures, too, it's not cold. It's actually average. <laughs> We've been so blessed with these warm temperatures, and uh, once we get into and beyond this next weekend, temperatures look to head back to where we're supposed to be this time of year. Not really seeing anything Arctic or any big time cool down, just more seasonal weather, which certainly uh, I think after what we've seen here, we can't really complain too much about that. Though tonight, 29 degrees, the patchy fog will be a concern in some areas. We'll continue to watch that seven day forecast. It shows uh, those warm conditions, pleasant conditions conditions for the next several days. And once again, we get to Thursday chance of those thunderstorms 61 degrees though. But once we get into the weekend, temperatures begin to tumble 42 Saturday, 40 on Sunday, a little bit closer to average once we get into the weekend. Inflation is coming down, including prices of